Hello! Um, yeah. Hello! Uh, I'm Errol, and this is Joe. Hello, all! And welcome to Let's Try to Play, and here's the mystery voice. Why don't you see any black cheese? Thanks, mystery voice. What are we playing? We are playing... I always ask that because I can <laughs> never remember. Oh, this doesn't look good. We're playing until dawn. Oh, are we? It's only half four. Oh, uh, oh yay. Good. Is this basically just cabin in the woods except with extra steps? By the look of it, yes. We're uh, part of a group that lost two people. Uh, I don't know if this happened yet or not. I'm I'm just enamoured by like the the visuals because we had the pause menu on, it looked quite nice. And now they're sort of walking around, it just looks like someone forgot I'll to I'll pause uh, it. Oh, isn't that a nice yeah, pause that's menu? That's nice. That's go that's gorgeous. Really? These on the other hand, it's just not menu. really rendered properly. They look a little bit Oh my god, that's yeah, there's a something uncanny valley about what it. What the hell is that? <laughs> are we are we all no. Oh, we're playing oh. hide and seek. Is it There's the intelligent one. Is someone going to come in and uh, set fire to the wardrobe we're all hiding in? Well, let's hope so. Mike. <laughs> yeah, okay, Mike. Mike. Let's let's try and label all of our uh, victims to be, shall we? Um. <laughs> well, you know, in traditional horror, you know. Movie what? Oh, genre. There's, there's Mr. Stabby well, there's, Kill. Yeah, there's there's Mr. Killer. Mr. Stabby hey. Kill. That's that one. Generic lady. The sweet virgin one, I imagine. Josh. <laughs> oh, I'm controlling. Oh, are you, are you controlling? Oh, uh, dearie me. Hang on. I'm screwing up because I'm trying to have a cigarette as well. Oh, for, you couldn't wait five minutes. Could I you? thought that there. Was, I thought that this was going to be like the order, and it would be about four hours of cutscene. <laughs> oh. Oh. I need to hold R2 to pick things up. And then rotate Whoop. them. Hannah, you look so damn hot in that shirt. But I bet you're even hotter out of it. Come to the guest. Oh my god. To be honest, what did if you if you take your shirt now? off, surely by the laws of physics you'll be less hot. <laughs> well, you you, you want to be warm. Especially in the woods. Yeah, I'm not going to take off my comfy jumper. Yeah. Uh... Well, Dear Lord, it looks... Quick, notice, there's a camera in the corner. It's following you around. Uh, oh, that arse. It does look... I don't know. It, it, this is really it reminding just, me of heavy rain. It just doesn't look finished. It looks like some, someone came up with the idea. They you know, storyboarded it and they've done, oh, done 90% of the work. I've just realised someone's in this chair. He <laughs> <laughs> um, blends so well into the background. Can't can't do anything with him. Well, go and have a little... What's all this... Is, ah, it, is this dust hanging about? Camera What's... angle changes, and as a result, start turning around. Mm. Use the right stick to look around. Objects that glint can be inspected. Well, let's inspect this glinty object. Oh, let's go. Oh, I've got to reach out again. What have we got? Well, Jeremiah Crag. Jolly good. Jeez, Josh. Uh -oh. Josh. Once the again, boys are drunk. What a surprise! Ah, ah, you know. nerdy but, one. Yep, nerdy one. Velma. The jock. Those teeth oh, go are on. scary. Maybe we should start with a little, you know, making out, and see where it goes from there. Yeah, um, no. Make out. Make one hole out. Did you? And then leave by it. Did you never see a horror film? Oh, hang on. We're getting we're getting a little bit too uh, <laughs> too PG thirteen here. Well, what are you doing here? That's pathetic. Uh, Hannah. I'm sorry, Hannah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, teen drama. Um, uh, yeah, well done. Upset the really smart, nerdy one. Now she's going to go and run into the woods crying. There'll be a creak and they'll go, who's that? And she's then going to post about it on live like this goes like, Bye. Use the right stick to choose. To choose what? what? The yeah. <laughs> oh, there you go. Find Are others or wake Josh. Oh, wake Josh. Josh, quick, you've got to go out there and get your stomach stapled to a tree. Right, okay, so I'm not waking Josh anyway. Well, that's good. <laughs> this. 
Hang on, where did where the fuck did that mansion come from? Hannah! <laughs> this is what? Not, it's not any wife? just any Hang cabin on. in the woods. This yeah. is, you know, like luxury this cabin. This is an M and S cabin in the woods. This is an M and S cabin in the woods. Oh dear. You jerks. Yeah. Quick, Hannah. run into the forest. So this is obviously very kind of teen slasher. Oh, oh hello. no, quick time events. If they want me to do anything with my left hand, we're screwed. I'm holding a cigarette. <laughs> Put your cigarette down, boy. No. Um, let's do <laughs> the safe, safe route. Yeah. <laughs> let's see how safe the safe route is. I think I'd watch a horror film like this where there were two options. <laughs> and you'd have to sit in the audience and, you know, obviously the loudest option. Everyone like shouting out in the audience, Save fast! Oh, I would hate to sit through a film like that. It's basically, though, every American. Follow footprints. Never follow the noise. <laughs> na, 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 na. Danny, I'm coming for you. Oh. It's extra from Hannibal. Am I going to get stabbed to death by a Wendigo? <laughs> Yeah, run at them. Jesus fuck shit. Jesus fuck shit. I don't think he does. That's not in the Bible. <laughs> Damn it, Hannah. The bit I read. Where are you? Uh. <laughs> I think there's something in Galatians. Oh, dear. Jump. <laughs> Never get back up now. Um, that's it. You're dead. Quick, get my phone. Oh, use the touch. Oh, I've got to unlock the... F oh, this is so interactive. Oh, th this. yeah, this is great. Left Hannah. stick, walk around. Hannah, Hannah. I've got a little talk. You can direct the light beam using the right stick. Ha ha, I'm at a concert. <laughs> Jesus Ooh. Christ, I hate those people. If you are one of those idiots that holds their phone up during a live concert, don't, <laughs> basically. I wasn't scared by that. The, amount, the amount of people... Oh, hold L1 to walk faster. Oh, brilliant. A slightly increased pace. I think every time you go to a concert, you should have your finger and thumb just sort of taped together. Hang on, there's before a you're allowed object. to walk I'm in. I'm going to interact with the glinty thing. Oh, I've got to reach out again. Is this shoot? What the hell? And turn it over. Oh my god, she's been turned into a wooden figure. <laughs> what was that? It's an idol with a small TV. Death in it. totem. Well, that that was. Um, a totem of your own death. Oh, I'm leaving footprints. Did we have? Did we have some kind of like fucking charmed premonition thing? I just said ha. Huh. I don't know why. I just said ha. Huh. Well, you always say ha. Huh. Huh? Hannah. Hannah. <laughs> she's bom, bom, she's bom. done the sensible thing to get the hell out of this game. Wow, that can't be a bad sign. That's probably normal, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> sort of well, you know, it's those trees that burst into flame every now and then. You know. Oh, I thought it was one of the fire beasts. Now you've got me worried. Anna. Oh, and there's a figure up there. Anna. Oh, there she is. Hello. Hello. Come on, love. Back we go. Come on, nerd. Oh, my God, you must be freezing. Yeah, get them out, Here. love. Take my <laughs> I don't think she's going to get them out in order to <laughs> stop being cold. Have you heard of paradoxical undressing? Oh, my God. Predators here. Oh yeah, that's what's yeah, supposed to have caused the death of those people on the Dyatlov Pass, wasn't it? Um, oh, the Dyatlov Pass incident is amazing to read about. Yeah, to read about. Don't watch the film. Oh, don't watch the film because it's terrible. Um, yeah, the Dyatlov Pass incident, a group of hiker skiers. Oh, I've lost my phone. <laughs> yeah, they went through the Dyatlov Pass, which was unnamed before this happened. Mm. And, they f and the team didn't report in at the base where they were meant to arrive a few days later. And uh, hang on, things are happening. I don't know what's happening. Wee! Oh, falling off cliffs is happening. Drop her, drop her. No. Oh, there's some fire again. Hold on. It's Hold just on. yes. <laughs> <laughs> Hello. Uh, let go. We'll let go. Let's not drop Hannah. Look, he's trying to save you. Ow. Well, I'm dead. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we're both dead. 
see what I say? You should have just dropped Hannah. No! Hannah Drop that woman. Nerdy. Ha, the anal list. Oh, dear. What? Yeah, the Outlaw <laughs> Pass incident. And they, f- and they found them in this uh, pass. And uh, their tent had been ripped open from the outside, according to the investigators. And most of the uh, team were either partially ripped open or just completely naked and dead. But it's partly to do with uh, what's known as paradoxical undressing, where when the last stage of hypothermia, your body feels incredibly hot. And so most people dying of hypothermia will start taking their clothes off and then obviously dying. But yeah, Dyatlov Pass incident, no one knows what caused it or what happened, and the Russian, well, the Soviet authorities hushed it all up. Dun, dun, dun. Well, I, I love how you have the scientific explanation of, you know, you know uh, the hypothermia, and you know, they just got lost and become paranoid and confused. That's why they ripped their own tent and all this sort of thing. And then it goes all the way to aliens did it. Because you oh, know them, the, them pesky the aliens, yeah. yeah. Well, no, just in like conspiracy theories, it's everything from like Soviet bomb explosions, zombies, radioactive dust. Yet I don't know, half pig, half horse things. You know. Oh, what your mum? Oh. <laughs> but yeah, there's yeah, there's all sorts of nonsense about it. But um, I'm not sure what to believe, and also I don't know enough. To know what to believe at all. No. Okay, Mr. Creepy Man. <laughs> I've got gloves on. That's all right. Oh. I see a scarecrow and a barn. Yep. And a barn made of scarecrows. A barn made of scarecrows. Stop smiling so at me, you weird f- freak. How did that picture make you feel? Remember, be honest. It made me feel like I... <laughs> It makes me happy. Yeah. That's good. It makes me happy. It's nice and, you know, calm, tranquil. If you've just seen this... I like scarecrows. The sunshine... Yeah, it's peaceful. Why is there not an I like scarecrows option? (laughs) (laughs) That should always be an option. (coughs) Would it make you happy to spend the whole week here all by yourself? Yep. Yes. Yeah. Fuck everyone else. If I had that, op- else is if I had that option of, you know, do you want to stay in a cabin in the woods by yourself? Yeah. Oh, but the woods are haunted. Yeah, hang on, you the sold cottage me. is haunted. But hang on, it's a barn. Yeah. I want to punch that guy already. Yeah, he's just... Nope. I wonder what it is. Although, Americans, I, I do love uh, how... This guy frightened me. <coughs> I do love how in America properties um, will go for less if the place is haunted. Apparently, they're very hard to sell, mm. which I just find absolutely hilarious because you know America with all its history. <laughs> <laughs> America's having so much bad luck; it's almost as if it were built on thousands of Indian burial grounds. <laughs> but uh, yeah, right. It's, I don't understand what's going on at all. No, did either. I just? kill my friends oh we've got some titles oh that'll explain everything i swear to god if we have to go through this all over again i think i might have to <laughs> crack my own head <laughs> against a rock and fling myself down a, a cliff but but what if there's a man with a flamethrower who wants to save your life i don't care oh okay <laughs> wait what <laughs> This isn't a picture. This is a real life look, scenario. Look, I I have studied horror films. You know, my degree in film. My speciality was in horror films, and <laughs> yeah, any slasher film, you name it, I've probably seen it. And <clears throat> you you know what to do in those situations. Anyone who doesn't look like a human being, run. Anyone who does look like a human being, run faster. Or Cause don't trust the man who turns up halfway through and says, hey, everything's fine. Yeah. Was Rami <laughs> Malik in this film? Is that Oscar winner Rami Malik? I don't know. Isn't that a bloke who played um, yeah, Freddie Mercury? Yeah, did Freddie Mercury, yeah. Oh, there you go, people. We bring you Oscar winning actors. Maybe it's a different guy. More than likely. <laughs> I don't know. I don't research these things before we play them. <laughs> what? 
Yeah, Just stick the disc in the machine. Does it work? Yes. Are we recording? Today is Good. The anniversary of the dreadful tragedy that took place on Mount Washington. Well, yeah, the most research that we did for this was we went into the second hand shop and it was eight pounds and we went, yeah, fair enough. Yeah. <laughs> I think it was a toss-up between this and some weird-looking Japanese anime. Oh, they're talking about the thing. dead girls. Good. We're all going to drive in the woods. <gasps> are we going to tell anyone where we are? No. <laughs> are we going to go and have a party in the same place a year later? Yeah, in on, you know, in honour of our fallen foes. Fallen comrades. Fallen, fallen comrades. Talking of comrades, nice Russian hat. Yeah. <laughs> Typical horror trope. Oh, don't want to go there. It's haunted or, you know, disappearances or or this sort of thing. And then one goes, yeah, let's go. Oh my god, it does. Yeah, it actually looks like... Yeah, look at it. It's like motion capture. Okay. I'm expecting him to burst into a queen song now. I want to say, I want to break free. <laughs> I want to get stabbed. I want to get stabbed. I bet he's the killer. I want to get stabbed in my eye. I don't want any pie. I don't need blood. I want to get stabbed. Should I just leave? Because basically, you're just rocking this whole entire. Yeah. All right. See you later, guys. God knows. God knows I want my Joe back. No, she's so gone. To me that we're doing oh no, she's dead. Hannah. I've just looked over and someone stabbed her in the face. I know it would mean so much to Hannah Ow. and Beth that we're we're all still here together, and I'm thinking of them. I really she's want to not really dead. Oh, for goodness' sake, be the killer already. Told you, you, told you, she wasn't dead. Just share some moments that. I want to get all my friends back together. So when all the weird shit happens, oh, it's not my fault. You know, there's obviously something weird going on. Oh, then and then I'll make it look like I've died somehow. And then, you know, I'll come back and go, Surprise, bitches, I was the killer all along. They're going to party like they're fucking porn stars. What? Just depression and STDs. <laughs> One hell of a party. Just ask my ex. Larry Fessenden gets special credit. Who? I'm guessing he's Mr. Stabby Death. Yeah. Metronomes are scary. Is this, is this Hannibal gonna be, taught us this. This is going to be like The Order, isn't it? Where we're just watching a film and every yeah, now and a, then they go, oh, press a button. A game that says it's got a screenplay is a pretentious game indeed. Oh, dear. Yeah, get on with it. This is going to turn out exactly like The Order, isn't it? It's just oh, going to be incredibly yeah. annoying. Mind you, The Order promised itself that it was an action game, whereas this isn't trying to be an action game. It's trying to be some interactive story. Mm. Which makes it great for a Let's Try to Play because we tend to ignore the story. <laughs> <laughs> this is Good old traditional go horror so well. tropes. Hang on, we got the bus there. We got the bus to the middle of fucking nowhere. One of my Why friends lives ten minutes drive from Canterbury and a bus goes near his place. <laughs> Hello. About twice a day, that's it. So, yeah, fuck's sake. See, I, I do get annoyed because obviously we've seen a bloke with a machete. Sam, Hannah's best friend. Sam! Diligent, considerate, adventurous. The I virgin. I bet you she is none of these things. No, she's diligent, but she hasn't Hello? noticed a guy with a massive machete behind her. <laughs> It's what annoys hey, me. the camera hid. You know, oh, a, a, horror, a horror film villain has got to have one weapon. Like, you know, your leather face with your chainsaw, Jason Voorhees with the machete. You can't just have, you know, him standing in the distance with a machete and then come up and go, oh, by the way, I've also got a flamethrower as well. You go, no, no. You can use the right one stick weapon. to move the camera. Well, jolly <laughs> but good. When it says move the camera, what it means is. The camera will drift slowly. Gates busted. Climb over. No, that's it. I'm, I'm waiting. It's over. <laughs> climb up. Climb up quick or climb up safe. Let's climb up safe. Yeah, because, you know. Oh. 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 
Ah, uh, quick time Lovely. event. You should have just done quick. Climb. <laughs> Climb. Tringle. Yes. Oh, yes. This I can press buttons when told to. Okay, this is going to be the future of cinema. You're going to have people sat in big cinemas with, you know, a control pad. And don't, they're don't going give to do anyone it. anyone ideas. It's going to be this. Well, Black Mirror did uh, Bandersnatch, which was quite good on Netflix. The choose-your-own-adventure oh, yeah. thingamajig. But I can't see that translating into cinema. Can oh, you? Did, oh, screw oh, you all. Kill it. You hungry? When the don't move icon is on, keep the wireless controller as still as possible. <laughs> oh, I'm guessing that's going to be because we'll be stalked later. Oh, more than likely. Okay. <laughs> Control your breathing by not moving the controller. <laughs> uh, if you're unsure of what to do next, you can see your current objective by pressing R1. Head to the cable car station. Okay. Oh, that's good. I'm heading there. It's always nice to see... Down this path of so many yeah, diverging so many paths. Lights, yeah. yeah, before before we started recording, they had a uh, video talking about, oh, you can change... Um, what is it? Each decision changes other things. Mm. And, uh, Bad the black butterflies, right? Okay. Okay. Yellow butterflies offer help, and so follow yellow and white. I think is the idea. Ah, <laughs> oh, there's a death totem. Is it a death totem? It will totem reveal a coloured butterfly and a premonition of a possible future. Oh dear, sweet Jesus! Why? I think I'm defeating the object of the game if, you know. Ah, oh, blue, black. What colour is the butterfly? Yellow. It's a, a guidance totem. Oh, uh, the future is uncertain. <coughs> right, okay. this... The future's always uncertain. Right. Well, going back to that Bandersnatch, did you hear about the um, company who made those, you know, uh, Create Your Own Adventure books that used to get, like, in the early 90s? They were trying to sue bag, Netflix and Charlie Brooker because they said they damaged the product. <laughs> yeah, how the choose how your own you adventure books, your which your have adventure. sold about five books in the last ten years. Um, let's close the bag. Well, you playing this safe, aren't you? No, I just refuse to. Oh, we've changed the narrative. Oh. Oh. Damn. Hey, you made it. Hello. Ah. I'm Has a crush on Ashley? Are we Ashley? No, we're... No, I... Maybe? Oh, so... I'm going to oh, have Jesus to remember Christ things like this. Justin Bieber. <laughs> I'm not going to tell you. you got to see for yourself. Come on, it's this way. Is it a dead corpse? <laughs> As opposed to a living corpse. <laughs> oh, dear. Oh, I'm having fun. Hey, this thing glints. I'm going to do a thing with it. Why? Milgram Victor is wanted. There we go. That's that's the uh, the red herring killer, probably. First degree arson offence. Ooh. Why like, was he arson around? Ha! It's my dad's favourite joke from uh, solve Wallace the and Gromit. We've got to solve a mystery. Well, we do look very And rewrite history. Duck tales. Woohoo! Why are you such in a singy mood today? I think... Um, no, I'm not thinking that's You're not thinking. thinking. <laughs> it's very it's like, generous of you to call it singing, isn't it's it? It's like usually you, the, the singing comes when you're scared. Now you're just upbeat singing. I'm not sure whether to be more terrified or whether, you know. Oh, run. Chris is a cable car station. Shit. Uh, are, are, are we pretending to shoot the things? I don't know. Oh, you are. Yes. There we go. Press I'll do the shoot. Oh no, did you break the game? Oh no, hang on, you got, I don't think you can shoot them. Huh? You stick to aim, that's it, then press R2. Yeah, that's what. Oh, the controller's vibrating up a storm. I think. Oh, hello. <laughs> I don't think your targets are going anywhere. Ah, do you know. <laughs> you just no, do you know what I'm doing? Well. I am using a controller where uh -huh. the R2 button is a bit dodgy. Oh, <laughs> I'm going to grab my other one. <laughs> Fill time. 
yes, uh, horror films. I I I do love these sort of games. They are fantastic. When it comes to uh, you know, I'm back. setting Hang on. everyone up. No, it's not your controller either. This game is janky. Go for bottles. I'm pressing R2. That's R1. What did... Uh... Oh, right. Oh, I well, need to finally. hit a specific target. Oh, but of course. Because we're not allowed a choice. Ah, oh, bye-bye cans. <laughs> the one choice you can't make in this game. <laughs> you can choose, you can choose yeah, who you've, dies, no, you've got you to know. Shoot the cans in the right order. And then you can shoot the bag. Oh, well, jolly good. Because yeah. this will help wow, in the uh, the quick fire round when <laughs> the murderer's coming after you and there's a squirrel in one tree, a badger like <laughs> down, down the bottom with like an explosive on. Choose which target to aim at. I'll aim at the oh, one. Oh, there you go. Well, anybody and their brother could shoot a bottle that big, that close. Ooh. All right, love. Right, shoot the fucking squirrel. No, don't shoot the squirrel. I think this is going to be a moral choice. Yeah. I'll shoot the bag. <laughs> I'm not shooting a squirrel. I want to shoot the blonde I, girl. Although I do quite like the, I the squirrel shoot is him still as well. sat there. He's just like eating nuts. What? Hey, oh, what white butterfly happened. Hey, is that good? I don't know. <laughs> yeah, the cable car up to this bloody hell yeah I've, really I've good um transport links to this cabin in the woods <laughs> <laughs> well that that's the whole point you know it, it's oh, I'm, I'm it's the guy. bridge it's the bridge that collapses because it gets blown up by squirrels or <laughs> yeah we only have one way to get to this place oh, i can look at this as well yeah. you bet your bottom dollar that that is going to be you know broken abandoned <laughs> set on fire by Mutant zombie thingies. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Christ. I hope not. I had such a problem with them when I was a kid. How? Um, I refused to watch it. And this is when I was some like seven or eight years old. And I refused to watch it because it was stupid. And my reason for thinking it was stupid is is not the fact that they're mutant turtles. Not the fact that they do karate or fight a bloke called Shredder. But because they are turtles, which are vegetarian, and they were eating pepperoni pizza. Th yeah. That really annoyed me as a kid. I'm just <laughs> oh, so fed up with that. I love those sort of like... Hang on, she just said hard on. Oh, God. I do love those sort of niggles, because when I ever come up with a niggle, it's always, oh, really, just enjoy it. Like the other day when I was watching the first episode of Ghosts, Again, new BBC yeah. program, and there's a bit where the uh, Ben Will Bond's captain walks through the door. Uh, you know, he's a ghost. Walks through the door, but then lies down to sleep on the bed. And my brain went, "No, don't, don't <laughs> say anything, don't say anything." And it was bubbling up inside me so much. And <laughs> no, don't say it. The bed's in the same place it was when he was dead. Shut your face. Yeah, but why wasn't the door then? <laughs> was the door just off its hinge? No, because he can't open and close the door. Yeah, but like. Oh, you just stop <laughs> it. The cable car's coming, Joe. Do you think it's got a murderer in it? No, it won't have a murderer on it. You probably won't Ooh. see the murderer until like an hour in. That's how it works. No, I'm looking at the uh, CCTV. Which is faulty. Love it. Uh, there's a bit of static. I'm just... Because that's the outside of the cable car station. I'm wondering if I'm going to see a man come in and try and kill us. <laughs> The first glimpse of something not right. <laughs> yeah. No, because you're not the hysterical woman. It's the hysterical woman that always sees the thing first. I must say, these camera, this uh, camera controls and walking controls are an absolute joy. Are we, when I are say we being that, a tad sarcastic there, Miss Daryl? No. Uh, no, not at all. Okay. Check the corners. <laughs> he sits down, the camera pans over, and there's just a man with a big knife. Hello. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> How do you do? Greetings. Can I wear what, your you skin? You went to your prom by cable car. Can, That's a way to can go. Can someone push someone out of this cable car, please? Look, I, I tell you, we'll play the game for an hour, and then, you know, just as the element of dark 
begins to descend upon us, the murderer will rear its ugly head, yeah. going, surprise, no, motherfucker. Yeah. I deny all knowledge of the element of dark, who's probably the killer anyway. <laughs> the element of dark is always the killer. <laughs> Oh, don't. We, ju we yeah, just sold Hollywood a film there. Everyone meets the element of dark. That's what it should be. You know, you know, like in horror films, when they're, they're looking at the camera, and they go, "Oh, it's you. What are you doing here? Wait, no, ah!" And then it obviously zooms up in their face, and it goes black. That could be a killer. You know, no one knows what's going on, and then at the end, it's revealed that there's blackness that is killing people. What, just this like, fucking weird shadow thing. Like people were dying because. They were they were being cut out of the film. No, no, but but you know, look, you know when it goes black. As soon as Can we try goes, this? Ah! Can we try this theory on John Malkovich, please? John Malkovich, how many do you? Um, acted in some films, and they're all awful. If anything, we should do it on reality TV shows. No. I like everyone I still on like the idea TV of shows. I still like my idea of Big Brother where you put ten people in a house and then you walk away. That was you know, my that was my idea. Oh no, my idea. No, you have never weird. actually had a conversation with you about this. It's no, that was we what we do is it's not ten people. You you send out you know, anyone who wants to apply to Big Brother, apply to this address. Everyone who replies, you tell them they've been accepted. You put them in a big warehouse, you close and lock the doors, and then you wander off. <laughs> and the problem that I have with that is that someone will want to fucking film it. And that really isn't the point. Oh, hang on. Mike's new girlfriend is trusting and irreverent. Well, that's always good. In a Choose Your Own Adventure, I like to be told the character motivations, because then I can really build up my own story in my mind. <laughs> it's not writing to say, hey, this character's brave. You just, why don't you just what do right? Hey, <laughs> uh, you guys having a really weird Behold stroke? the jump. I'm having a weird yeah. stroke. Stupid thing. Can you please let us out? Pretty please? No, I'm just going to Do leave I have the there. option to? <laughs> no, <not>? Yeah. <laughs> I love that just janky sort of. Uh? Yeah, I d I uh. had to press the button for that to happen. Oh my god. I thought we were goners. Another goners. Goners. No, don't do that. Oh, he's going to have his leg cut off at some point. That's how he's going to die. Because he just hope said it. So. He just said it. He said, Oh, I would have rather have my leg cut off. If someone is very specific about a certain death or like a, a body <laughs> mutilation, you can bet, hands down, that that is how they're going to meet their end in a horror film. Yeah, as soon, as soon as you're aware that you're in a horror film, go, Oh, I, I really hate. Um, I really hate hookers. I really hate ice cream. I hate jellies. Oh, here it is. Here's loads of it. Oh no! I said. Uh, yeah, I, I try not to do that as a rule. Come on, Jess. You can tell us. Yeah, Jess. I, I, I love how they're still standing yeah. out there, not yeah, freezing not their sweet right, patooties off. Sweet patooties. I mean, even though they've got coats and. Um, uh, and the like. You know, I, I've been in that sort of situation. You can't just stand around and have a natter. Why are you going to wait here for a bit? What? I, I'm going back in. I mean, I'm, I'm going underneath, whoever. you know, e even like the shittiest light bulb in the hopes of getting some kind of heat. I mean, holy cow. Sometimes I forget. Yeah, look, just the, the wind is obviously whipping up some. <laughs> I'm, I'm going where there's the smallest amount of heat. Oh, oh there's Emily. The bitch oh, one. no. But no, they're all intelligent. I bet you they're bloody um, not. Yeah, they're not. <laughs> They've gone to a cabin. That's Matt, Emily's new boyfriend. Who is Emily the one we just saw? And where's the bellboy? Uh, yeah. No, that was Jess. I've got bags. Can I throw them at someone? <laughs> Come in handy when you've got to uh, <laughs> ward off the villain. <laughs> no, get back. One of them just said that they're getting chills. Okay, so you can oh. calm down about how cold they are. One of them's acknowledged it. Oh, for goodness oh, sake. <laughs> See? Killer. Douchebag. He's intelligent as no, well. No, no, he's really <laughs> not. <laughs> Michael. He's, Michael, you're he's the, the Joker only one of the pack. Want. 
Oh, Yay! Yeah. It's like that really annoying kid from Friday the 13th Part 2 who just <laughs> makes it his mission to just jump scare every single Surely person. Surely that's Friday the 14th. <laughs> if they want to keep him with the numbering. What's wrong with you? No, that's not the that's not the point of the Friday the Thirteenth movie, movies. The fact that they had planned a oh, sequel. Hang on. Not she's his ex. Um, oh, go on, threaten, go on. No. Michael, I'm just gonna lay it out. Otherwise, <laughs> this whole weekend's gonna suck ass for everyone. Heh, <laughs> you suck ass. This is super awkward. This is like super awkward. It. Let's just uh, acknowledge it now and move on. So basically, okay. everyone's yeah. been screwing with man. everyone else. I, I don't want to make this weird. We're good. Well, look, he's the high school jock. You guys gonna make <coughs> out now? Yep. Oh my god, totally. We're so gonna make out. Oh my god. Wow, gosh. incredibly uh, inappropriate. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> is what the millennials will say. I have no problems with people right, hang on. doing the old oh. When we play as Mike, should we? If if we play as Mike, yeah. Should we try and get him killed as soon as possible? <laughs> because he's driving me insane. Yeah. All the bags. Um, he, like I said, he either is going to end up as the killer or he'll okay. be one of the last to go. Because you need someone to go, Mike, stop dicking about. Where is so and so? I don't know. Yes, you do. Let's agree. Let's just be the, God, the peaceful, this peaceful like, man. You basically made Matt into a so doormat. <laughs> doormat. Right but you owe me one. Yeah. Excuse me? Yeah. Well, the more even, at least. I'll think about it. Just Take be careful. your luggage. You up there, sweetie. Thank you. Yep, you can go off after your ex, and that's Wow, what a bitch. Fine. Yeah, these... I she has don't really kind of care about any of these people. It keeps saying there's a status update, and just sort of... Oh, all right, then. There's probably the status of your... Um, oh, yeah, you're meant yeah, to press R1, breaking, aren't yeah. I? To go... Oh, hang oh, on, go. Ashley. There's a new one. She she's gonna have character traits as well. Ah. Let me guess. She's very she's, curious. Let me guess. <coughs> she's intelligent. Is. <laughs> I'm what the fuck. Am I doing now? I'm gonna bagsy this one as probably. Ashley has a crush on Chris. Right. She's not. She's not intelligent. She's academic. Difference. Oh, oh someone found <laughs> <Major> the thesaurus. <laughs> I'm, I'm gonna I'm gonna place some money on her being the first oh, to go, hello. because she's I'm seen things she shouldn't have been seeing. Oh, 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 oh! I don't know who those people are. <laughs> they're they're the exes, and obviously they're kind of standing very very close together. Would you like a freezing hand job? Oh, I knew oh that was gonna Christ. happen. I <laughs> oh, I didn't. <laughs> I'm not great with jump scares. <laughs> I was waiting for you to move it a little bit further. <laughs> <laughs> I was just about. Oh my gosh! I was just like, about to say something about Papa. Beat me oh to it. God, I hate you, Joe. <laughs> <laughs> hate everyone in this game <laughs> and you. The thing is, I I'm the really. Oh. Hang on. No. Mr. Oh no no no! Let's screw uh, things up. Sure. Uh, go go ahead. Knock yourself out. Yes. How cold uh, is your hand job? Now you basically just doomed them two to no, die. Man. Good. Nothing you think Which two? <laughs> These two. You basically started conflict. Yes. She was the one that instigated said conflict. <laughs> which everyone will go, oh, yeah, she was the one who made me look at you two, you know, embracing. And therefore, this sweet well, little girl is going to be the first to go. He shouldn't have jumped out and gone boo. Oh, I remember this one. Oh, Jesus Christ, we're back here again. Yeah. So it's kind of like Hollyoaks level. Of Do I read bad. my book or check the phone? I'll check my phone because I look vapid. <sighs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> what is book? Oh, my God. <laughs> you did not just do that. Put your hands where I can see it. We've got you surrounded. There's a snake in my boot. <laughs> <laughs> what choice do I, a supple young rebel girl, have? But the See, again, look, let me roll snowballs with my bare hands. I'm going to grab a snowball. Blimey, that One, was easy. Two, three, four. Get him. Oh. Go on, get him, Ma. Oh, God. 
Uh, holding that thing for like 10 seconds. Shut up! I, d I hate, I really do hate it takes, snow. It takes me about five seconds to work out that I'm supposed to be pressing a button. <laughs> oh, I love it. Make out music. I dodged you, mofo. Hey, it's a bird. That's so well out. Oh, no, you're going you're gonna to hit the bird, aren't you? Hello? No. <laughs> Lead the target, Jess. <laughs> <laughs> Sniper assassin snowball mode. Oh Everything so sometimes doing nothing is the right thing to do. Hide from me, Michael. I know all your tricks. Oh. Yes, doing doing I'm not gonna hurt a bird. <laughs> Thank you, kind lady. Off I go <laughs> I'm gonna throw a snowball at this prick. Stick an icicle through. It's the perfect oh. sort of snow where you don't throw it at someone and there's a huge lump of ice in it. <laughs> because that always happens. That's <laughs> why I'm so glad of global warming for giving us yeah. no snow in England. <laughs> now you bring your knee up now, darling. Get him right in the kadoolies. My, my. So are we calling it my favour then? You're worthy opponent. Miss Jessica, the snowball queen. Go on then, okay, make out, so we can tick queen. you on the list, off the <laughs> list of ones to be murdered later on. My lady, I'm going to grab a snowball. Yeah, do it. Your chances of survival uh. have just gone up. Well done, you're not going to be the first no. to die. I can think of at least one thing. Yeah. So Are you going to try and say it's smaller because it's snowing outside? Oh, God. <laughs> yeah, it's so nice out here, And though. to be honest, who wants to have I mean, sex I in the snow? Hey, babe, I've got this fantastic ever, idea, yeah? We've watched the stars, yeah? In the snow? No, yeah. okay, get a blanket. Oh, no, 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 I was thinking of, you know, well, go in the whole well, hog. I think we might um, no. I was, I was coming I back. don't want frozen nipples. Really? <laughs> you're going there you the go, wrong you way found your tagline for that. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want frozen nipples. Oh, here we go. Killers, no, I was killers turned up. Hello. <laughs> well, I was walking back home um, from the city. I was a little bit drunk um, one evening. When, when are you not? <laughs> uh, oh, some Tuesdays. But, uh, yeah, I was a little <laughs> bit drunk. But I walked past, um, well, walked through the alley behind my house in order to get to my house. And there was a drunk couple of students having sex in that alley up against a lamppost. Brilliant. And my first thought was, all oh, classy. And as I walked past, I just tapped her on the shoulder. He was holding her up at the time. What? I tapped her on the shoulder and said, I bet he told you it was a cold night as well. <laughs> and then she fell off. It was very funny. You know what? I don't know whether to believe you or not, because... <laughs> that just sounds so incredibly English, sort of just to happen. Genuinely happened. Whilst they're having said, <laughs> excuse me, my dear, are you a bit nippy? Would you like a cup of tea? <laughs> right, which makes us anxious? Oh, <laughs> Don't I'm, all, I'm no. sitting next to Joe. Hashtag women. me too. <laughs> I'm sitting next to Joe. Women worry you, me. You have, you have just... Women worry me. Planes worry me. Oh, Is no, we're going to have a plane land on the cabin. A plane full of women. I fear will drowning or I fear heights. You fear heights. A plane full of women will come from high up <laughs> and land on me. Carrying right, snakes rats. Snakes <laughs> don't scare me. Neither do rats. And I quite like snakes or danger noodles. I don't mind so, snakes. Oh. Guns aren't scary. <laughs> no, we live in America. <laughs> People with guns are scary. <laughs> I'm, I'm still going to stick with the snakes because we're going to have to kill a snake, aren't we? I, I did take my nephew once. On a plane full oh, of women. Okay. Oh, which one? Which one, Joe? Neither. The Joker or the Scarecrow? Cloth face. Cloth face? <laughs> <laughs> well, I think less people are scared of, you know, Fewer people. those than... Oh, shut up. Gorgeous. No, Oh, yeah, gore disgusts me. Then we can see some real gore. No, because uh, crows are scary. I want it. Oh. All right. Did that startle you? So sorry. No, you've just been a prick. You're not a trained well. therapist, are you? Don't be <laughs> He's the bloke who's following us. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God, I bet it is. 
try to speed up. The more you rely on your instincts, the more honest your answer. Well, there we go. And the more do, do, you do. find this experience. Yeah. Oh, my Hannibal like Lecter. That. Jesus Christ. Oh, snakes are still scary. It does kind of look like Anthony Hopkins. Um, crows are still scary. Hannibal Lecter. I just want to see loads of snakes and crows. Well, we are out in the open. Oh. <gasps> zombies! I'll choose zombies <laughs> because you're a big fan of zombies. <laughs> zombies just annoy me. Oh, oh, if I say I fear dogs, we might get to kill a dog. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> Thunderbolts and lightning. Very, very, very frightening, frightening me, <laughs> Galileo. <coughs> oh, We're answering so diligently. Uh, can I eat your liver <laughs> with some farm Zombies beans and, and a nice Chianti? Snake zombies and dogs. <laughs> Are they all going to be female snake zombies and dogs <laughs> yeah. on an aeroplane? <laughs> yeah, who will have like, <laughs> qualifications for flying a plane? <laughs> well, I'm afraid, once again, we're out of time. But right, if your therapist offers two-minute long it. sessions, he's not a very good therapist. Probably not a real therapist. No. And you should fear him. He's going to you eat you. You should fear him as much as you fear anyone who pronounces the word children. Children. He does have that Anthony Hopkins Hannibal. Previously on. Wait, what? What? <laughs> Are we going to get a summary of what happened? Yeah, just so, you know, we've oh, only yeah. been playing this game for the last hour. Yeah. No, we've already forgotten what's happened. <laughs> what's going on? Where's my sister going? <laughs> it was just a prank, hand. Or do we get to, like, choose again about what happens? <laughs> no. Yeah, God, I hope not. Canonically, these women are dead. <laughs> Told you. First off, I gotta say, I am super excited. Oh, dude, why, why is there a, a recap? Because it's cinematic. Previously on or Charmed. badly written. <laughs> you don't see that very often nowadays in we'll in TV again. shows. Like, For yeah, back in the 90s when you had, like, Buffy the Vampire Slayer and Charmed and all that kind of paranormal bollocks. Last week on. Oh. Yeah, it would all be last week on. Oh. Previously on Battlestar Galactica. Yeah, you don't see yeah. that very often nowadays, do you? Butterfly effect. Yeah, you you see it even more rarely. Twenty minutes into a game. <laughs> <laughs> Man, I feel like this Jealousy. Every time I Nine climb, hours I until yeah. dawn. Yeah, we got this, man. We got this by the ass. Wait, there's someone else. No, this is Josh. This is the. Oh, he's complex. Yeah. Ah, uh, I bet you he isn't. No, that's the one I said was going to be the murderer, because he's the bloke who's invited everyone to the team. Oh, yes. Oh, yeah, because it's uh, Freddie Mercury. Yeah, and he's probably the only person who was known before this came out. <laughs> what is it about that kind of Midsummer Murders, isn't it? A show over in, in England, I don't know about the rest of the world. Midsummer Murders is basically just, you know, crimes happening in a little tiny village called Midsummer. No. Basically every week. No, it's, I know set it's in the County of Midsummer, oh, county of Midsummer. which is why there are so There's many so murders many, yeah. there. But it's, it's not one village; it's loads of pretty. But, it, but it's quite brilliant because you know you'll have like you know the opening yeah, credits where you know random people are. I'm going to gossip. Oh, why not? Because it looks like the kind of douchey thing mm. I do. Yeah, you'll, you'll have all like the random people that are like you know extras or something like that, and then it will come up and special guest Dame Judy Dench as Beth. And you're like, well, she's the killer. Yeah, she's the killer. Yeah, <laughs> it's just so <laughs> damn obvious. <laughs> He's like, all these people you never heard of. Oh, Benedict Cumberbatch as Bob. Oh, there we go. <laughs> Bob Dick Cumberbatch. Bob's gonna get his killing spree on. They both probably appeared in Midsummer Murders, or some something like that. I think we've got to break into the house that we own. Yeah. I'm fully on board with understanding what's happening. Hi, Chris. Hi, timid girl. Oh, what shall I be? Be confident. Yeah. Because like you know. A dick. How are you doing? Mm. How are Good, you doing? A little cold. All right, Bobo. Bo. <laughs> 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 yeah. Me, Does big strong good. man. You, weak female. Hey, can see tits now, please? <laughs> <laughs> please. Yeah, are we going to get some like nudity tits. in this? Because every other know. every other horror film. Comes with, you know, the tit shot. Yeah, as soon as you get your tits out, you get stabbed in the face. Yeah. Like the trick is, 
kind of gal, you know? To not I get your tits out. That Parker right off of her and make some snow angels, right? Do you mean come all over her face? Get out, man. <laughs> I'm going to agree, because that's deep. Yeah, I'm a red-blooded man. Ah, the bone zone. Ah. That zone that people talk about when they're still virgins. Is <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I ploughed her so hard. I ploughed her furrow until seed came out of her nostrils. Yeah. I mean, can you imagine a more perfect, ripe scenario? We were like going for hours, man. Yeah, I can. And Ashley, alone at last. I can imagine a better scenario, i.e., you're not there. Perfect gentleman. Now you come in for the kill. Yep, kill her and then touch her bum. I love that realization when you press it. Ooh, yeah, just I've come to an understanding. The canary tilting its head to one side. I understand. Wait, wait for the tilt of uh, is that is that carbon monoxide? I turned off my carbon monoxide alarm. Its constant beeping was making me feel a bit nauseous and dizzy. That's what an anti-vaxxer sounds like. Oh, fucking anti-vaxxers. You know, I'm all right for you having beliefs. Oh, there's an open window. Like that, Quick, let's... Let's break it down. Let's climb in. I'm sure that no one else has had that thought first. Clue found. Axe holder? Oh, yeah, it's gone. Someone took the axe. Who the fuck has an axe holder? What are those in case of emergencies? Or in case bad guy has dropped his weapon and can't find oh, it yeah, that's please true. break glass if you're here to stab all of the teens in this uh is that a joke from scream or something well, well, well we got ourselves a thinker nice one give it some oh, i've got to keep moving oh. this right stick to the right to the left sorry and oh this is exciting yeah they open this, it up and find there's a dead exciting. body stuck inside it they're gonna get through the window and then it'll crack open and a hand will fall out it's one of the two dead girls <laughs> Joe. Yeah. We made them die. I know. Great. <laughs> I know. Yes. <laughs> yes. That's the more, best please. Bit of the game so far. Come on. I'm going to get into more scenarios where we can kill you. Okay. Chris is slightly okay, injured. Good. You had climbing, climbing class? class? Yeah, you know, with the climbing up the rope. Oh, <laughs> no, I think that's what you call gym. Did I do that? Did How I often was Chris what, climbing your up magnetic gym? powers? Here. This. No. Fucking mag <laughs> Magneto. Whoa, Chris, I just got an awesome idea. Yeah? Yeah. Totally. W what is it? Okay, so I'm pretty sure that I've got some deodorant in one of the bathrooms. You could use that with the lighter. I, I don't uh, know. no. How the stick of deodorant going to help. Spray on, it's a can. Oh, right, so yeah. what, we're going to set no, fire to something? Yeah, you you, you like want me to set fire dudes. to the cabin? Yep, ones we melted. Just point the spray can and the lighter. I, um, I thought we were trying to get into a house. Yeah. Oh, the lock's frozen. Ah, oh, right. We'll break the lock then. <laughs> <laughs> who's got a hammer? Or who's got a spade? Oh, dear. Are you telling me not one right, of... All of these guys are dicks. Yeah. So let's kill them all. Behold the writing of horror films. <laughs> oh, hello. We got a totem thingy. Yeah, what colour's the butterfly? I don't know. There you go, look. <laughs> oh, everyone on fire. A lost, a lost totem. totem. Yeah, so I think ba I think that's... If we, g if we go and get keep the... Keep track of my totems. Brown lost the potential loss of a friend. Uh-oh, spaghettios. Yes. Yeah, let's, let's I, rec I reckon let's that's what's going to happen then, yeah. If, if we're going to let... Do, 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 Very do, rarely do, in do, horror do, films do, do, do they do. die because of their own stupidity. Oh, wait, no. <laughs> Every time. But usually it's the stupidity that leads them into the path of the killer, not the stupidity of I'll set myself on fire and try and recreate the Fantastic Four. That's cool. Why is that cool? Family portrait. Oh, it's got dead girl in it. Dead girl on a jet plane. <laughs> Generic family portrait that, you know... Yep. Can't we no, have it's family? a clue. Oh, it's a clue to the fact that, that she was loved. Ah. Uh, uh, huh? Huh? Wait, what, what happened? Was that was a door. What? Oh, to the left. The door. The door opened. Oh, did it? Yeah. 
<laughs> you're dead in a horror film. <laughs> so a clue up the killer's <laughs> that way, and she's like, "What's that? What was that?" Oh, I, probably I just walk just up walk to the off. killer. Excuse me, someone's been killing people. You've not seen them, have you? <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, you're bleeding. Are you okay? <laughs> oh, what do you mean? It's not your blood. That's strange. <laughs> but you get a bit claustrophobic in that mask. Chris, very funny. Hi, Chris. Oh, how'd you know it was me? Because <laughs> no one else is as much of a dick as you. <laughs> and well, that's saying dicks. something. What is with all the dust particles floating um, around? I know they're trying to make it look more authentic and the like, but it's... I'll just point out, if you've ever been to an American mountain in winter, it's very dusty. Wait, isn't this the office of the psychiatrist? Yeah, TV. Yep, I needed to interact with it twice in order to try and turn the TV <laughs> on. Uh, oh no, the power's out. Oh, is there anything hiding behind the sofa? If I could walk around the back of the sofa, I would tell you. <laughs> but I can't. Yeah, this is reminding me of heavy rain. Just a bit of... You wander about looking for something to interact with. Oh, yeah. And then you do, and you're sorry you did. <laughs> Uh, but Heavy Rain did it to such a ridiculous degree. Right, what am I trying to do? I'm trying to go to the bathroom. To right. Find the can. Okay. Where is the bathroom? Well, isn't it usually. Well, I don't know about you, but my bathroom's usually upstairs. Ah, this is not upstairs. <laughs> <laughs> I love I love how you're walking down the stairs just holding the lighter by your wang. Just sort of... I can move the lighter around. I I'm, can hold I'm, it over my head. I know, but I'm, it was just the way it was positioned. Okay, so if I, I don't do that, care about quick, my body being cold. Play some kind of hard rock ballad. Oh, <laughs> I'm so surprised he hasn't dropped it yet and gone, ah. Oh. No, the bodies of um, Zippo lighters don't get that hot. Or really other fat, brand sort of. similar lighters. Oh, uh, we found another clue. It's got I'm the murderer written on it. <laughs> Josh with his lovely sisters in Cape Cod. Well, that's Aww. good. Whilst everyone outside is freezing their asses off, <laughs> we're just going to... Yeah. Oh, is that how this game goes? If you spend too long looking for a stick of... Um, looking for a spray can Yeah, they turn into Jack Nixon at the you end of just, The Shining. Yeah, you just open it <laughs> up. And they're all there. One of them's found an axe from somewhere. Okay. <laughs> 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 This <laughs> would just be the horror film, just one bloke just like walking around and then he finally finds like, the the key for the lock. <laughs> Found it, walks outside, all this blood. Holy shit, what happened here? <laughs> Police have turned up. Where the fuck were you? <laughs> I was downstairs looking for a key. You know, oh, what happened here? Everyone's dead. Some, some films always do a little uh, post credit sequence oh, God, thing. Yeah. They should do like some horrible slasher thing, or like Saw, where there's just a warehouse full of blood mm. and it just shows this janitor going, Oh, fuck's sake. <laughs> and that's it. Just this bloke with a mop complaining that he's yeah, got to do all of this cleaning up. find anything that could lead to a sequel or any shit like that. Just turns up and goes, I come back. <laughs> and then <laughs> just shakes his head and walks out the door. Yeah, fed up. Not, not doing this anymore. We, we need more lemon pledge. <laughs> 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 just turns around to his what, friend. You've made a promise to the lemons? <laughs> <laughs> Julio, get the big sponge. <laughs> The biggest sponge you can find. <laughs> That's Paris Hilton, isn't it? God. That was probably the only that good was either bit a about clever joke or a cheap shot, and I'm not sure which. I can't remember what horror film. I want to say she was in House of Wax, the god awful remake that didn't need to be remade. And yeah, she's in it. And you, you does the house melt at the end? You know what? I don't know. I've never actually watched it all the way through because it's that bad. You know, but, you oh, know. I thought we could carry on around this corner. Obviously not. Well, okie dokie. Wow, this, 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 is, this is absolutely it's gripping. Oh, it's gripping stuff, isn't it? Right. W if you were a bathroom, where would you be? Uh, the back of the house? I have no idea what the back or the front of the house no. is. No. <laughs> oh, oh. Well, <laughs> dark <that's> room. <laughs> Hello. That's fully illuminated. Aha! Oh, it's a room with a bath in it. Jesus. That's not a bath. That's a fucking hot tub. <laughs> that is that is plenty of room for everyone to get naked later on, and I expect that to happen. <laughs> 
<laughs> everyone getting all soapy and you know <laughs> I have spoken and everyone gets <laughs> out because someone farted and that usually the, like the bloke in there going it's not that bad and then yeah, like, he, he gets stabbed through like the plug yeah, this hole this is an interesting jacuzzi it's not a jacuzzi <laughs> oh, oh my Christ sake. oh <laughs> why the fuck is there a raccoon in a cabinet right okay <laughs> Oh. That was bloody brilliant. Always, always end on a high note. Oh, that was bloody brilliant. Um, <laughs> oh fuck's sake! It's those sort of jump scares that are, that make me laugh. I'm the, I'm the nutcase laughing their ass off in the cinema whilst everyone goes, "Oh, you bastards!" Sort of thing. <laughs> and they're just creasing up. <laughs> oh Hang on. dear. Hang on, we need to be quiet for a minute and maybe get some low rumbling music in. I thought I'd make the element of darker jump scare this week. Anyways, that's uh, <laughs> <laughs> here I am trying dawn. to create art and held back by Joe. Been from until dawn. Yep, Mr. Errol. Oh no, uh, hang on! I I started this, oh, so I'll then. I'll damn well finish it. <laughs> I'm just, sorry, I'm on the pause screen now and I'm just looking at Chris's douchey face. Yeah, just chatting. <laughs> this up. <laughs> what? <laughs> this up, I need the bathroom. <laughs> oh, right. Okay. Uh, Share that with all the listeners. All right, this this has been me, Errol. That's been Joe. Toodle Pip. Yep, she's, she's literally jumping up to go to the toilet now. And while she does that, for the last time, here's the mystery voice. It's a bit like a loofah on the old flesh but the inside. Thanks, mystery voice. Yeah, the the problem with Joe being gone is um, we can't have some sort of comedy end to this. So it'll just be a bit of a letdown, like Chris was to his parents, I think.